today we are going to learn about the shortcut key actually in uh, some software companies or some companies or some offices they never uh, agree to use uh, mouse because every professional should uh, maintain keyboard keyboard and shortcuts in keyboard so many many companies are on that Uh, they will uh, never allow uh, to do in. Uh, uh, they never allow to do with uh, mouse work with mouse. So uh, we have to learn shortcut keys. So it's very easy. I never tell you we used to learn uh, A to Z, and after that uh, A to Apple and uh, B to Boy, C to Cat. Uh, in those formats, and uh, in computer world, the same way A to Z we have to learn. Uh, it's very easy, and shortcut keys are very uh, very useful. And when you people watch the video, and if you people perfectly learn uh, these kind of uh, shortcuts, you will never use, and you will never like to use mouse. And uh, even your uh, offices and uh, even in your companies, they might appreciate you people. Um, so now we'll uh, see the we open the word document, and in this first we'll uh, learn about the control. Okay, so uh, here uh, if I uh, if I select the control A. Control B, you can't see. You people can't see. That's why I'm opening virtual keyboard. Virtual touch keyboard. See here. Ah, uh, in this I'll show. So that uh, here you can watch. Ah, uh, enter the thing. Okay. So. Ah, uh, first, first what we'll learn. A in A to Z what we'll learn. First, A for apple. So same way here, Control A. See here we can see Control A. Select the entire word. Control A. It will select the entire word. And uh, selection, selection of entire word file. Whatever we have uh, wrote a note uh, on word, it will select the entire thing. And uh, here, uh, A completed. A we got. Now Control B. Control B is bolding, bolding the entire document. Control B. Control B is for bold of entire document. And next, next, Control C. See here, what is the copy? Control C is for copy. Control C. It copied the entire document. Okay. It copied the entire word document. Control A for selecting the entire word. Control B for bolding the entire word. And Control C for copying. Copy. Entire word. And next, Control D. Control D for deleting the. Control D for deleting the document. Okay. Control D for deleting the entire word document. So. We we learned Control A, Control B, Control C, and Control D. Now, now we have to learn after D, Control E. Now we are going to learn about Control E. Control E is for Control E. Here we can. Control E. It will uh, document will come in between. 
in between the uh, page page of word control e for doing in between page of word okay then next after e what will come control f control f see here when i typed f it came here here i'll show in the board keyboard control f see here control f is nothing but to find the find the words uh, in our document if we are having any words difficult uh, to search in this file you have to type type over here and then press okay then here you can find the document in uh, in document we can find the words whatever we are searching see here uh, i just placed some lines but uh, in uh, in office or uh, in any uh, other places uh, we will uh, will do big uh, uh, file will create a big file so it is very difficult to search at the time here if we give the word so it will show the word over here if we we'll type control f control f is to find the document next control g control g here we have to close this control g control g is to go see here we got go enter page number see uh, when we type the word document if in our office our boss gave us uh, to type 10 uh, pages so we'll type 10 pages and we'll uh, uh, take print outs and uh, when uh, particular uh, particularly some page they are asking some section some line or some uh, something uh, they are particularly asking so at that time you can uh, press control g and then next it will show the document where we have kept the line bookmark or something comment anything whatever will be there it will show over here it will uh, click control g and uh, after g h now we will click control h control h it will show the history it will open the history history box control h whatever we accessed uh, it will open that box control h and next control i a b c d e f g h next i control i see here control i is nothing but italic italic <coughs> it will show an italic word control i control j control control j is nothing but justification if see uh, see if my document has went over here and uh, i am typing one letter to uh, some uh, official uh, officer i am typing a letter to official uh, official letter to an officer and my lines has became very bad see like this now can i produce this to any higher official no i cannot produce this thing to higher official because it is not good position so at that time what we have to do first control a select the entire word and then control j control j here entire line will 
be in same order. Control J is for justification. Justification of Word document. Okay. Control J. And next, after J, Control K. Control K. Type over here. See here you got an folders, folders, browse page, recent file, bookmarks, target frame, entire thing we got here. And next, control, control L. Control L means document will go to left side. This is the left side. This is the right side. So document, the entire document, entire document will go to left side. Control left. And next, control M. Control M. Merging the document. Control M is nothing but merging a document. And uh, after M, till now what we have learned? Control A, Control B, Control C, Control D, Control E, Control F, Control G, Control H, Control I, Control K. Control L, Control M, Control N. Control N, type here, Control N. New word has been opened. Control N, it will open new one. Control N. Okay? Control N. Next O. Next one we have to see Control O. Control O for open. Control O. O for open. It opened the entire word documents. See here. It opened the document. Opening of document. Control O is open of document. Next. Whatever we learned. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O. And next, P. Here again we will type Control P. Control P is for taking the print. Print of this document. Control A is to take print of. See here, printer option came. Print. Print all pages. Print one side A. Here A. Entire print option came. So, control P is for print of the document. And next, Q. Control Q. Control Q is apply single spacing to paragraph. Applying of single space. See here we are having how much space? 
it has become single space see here we can uh, give paragraph over here 1.15 i am giving 1.15 see here i gave 1.15 So uh, to bring it single, control Q, it became single line. It became very near. So control Q is for applying single space to paragraph. Okay, control Q. Next, control R. Control R for right side. document has came to right side see here for left side we saw this uh, small uh, uh, small uh, words over here at right side and uh, for control left uh, control l we are seeing this document over left side left and right this is left side and this is right and next control yes control s is to save the document control s see here i am not having the mouse so i can't save over here this is the save option na huh? so i can't save so in keyboard only we have to learn so here control yes it will save the entire document so till now what what we learn a b c d e f g h i j k l m n o p q r s next t u v w x y z is balance so now we have to learn t control t control t is to text the document control t is to text the entire document okay control t and next u control u control u is to underline the document here we are seeing underline lines appeared over here control u is to underlining of the document here you just control u you have to click in your you have to type in your keyboard whatever the hard hard drive is there whatever the keyboard is there you have to manually uh, you have to click over the uh, these options in your keyboard you are not using mouse so here just to show you people i am using the mouse okay control u for underline if you don't want to use uh, underline control u control u next control v control v is here you can see control v v for paste just now we in a c option control c we copied the document control c we have copied the document and now control v we are pasting the document just now we copied the document and now we have to place over different page so control v is to paste paste the document so we are pasting the document okay control w control w is currently uh, it close current open document see here control control w what it is asking want to save your changes to new microsoft word document if you click don't save 
a recent copy of the file will be temporarily available. So save, don't save or cancel. These three options you can take any option. If you want to save the document, you save. If you don't want to save, don't save. If you want to uh, additional some document, so just click on cancel. Okay. And now we'll uh, learn about uh, control X. See here, control X, what is that? To cut the document. Control X is to cut the document. Here you see, here you see, just uh, I selected one document over here. I selected and uh, and I don't want these uh, lines. So what I'll do? Control X. I deleted the document. Control X is to cut the document and see here. Control V. It pasted the document. Control X is to cut the document. Whatever line you want to cut, just press Control X. And now I want here same document. So control V to add a document. Okay. And uh, control Y. Control Y. What is the control Y? Redo. Redo means if by mistakenly I have deleted this document. See. Control. See. I deleted the document. My document, entire document has gone. Invisible. Now I want the entire document. So, just take the keyboard and control Y. Document entire document. Whatever the, the thing was there, uh, it will appear in same way. And now, uh, uh, by mistakenly, if my document has been deleted, so undo that document. Control Z is to undo. And uh, redo and undo is same. Redo and undo. Redo is control Y. Control here is it. Control Y. Gone. Document gone. Control Z. Document came. Past action. What, what was the past action? Depends on that. Redo and uh, y, uh, undo you must do. Control Y if you press it will remove that. Because my past action I did I removed this document. That's why when I press the control Y uh, this document has been gone. And uh, now I want the document. So control Z. Entire document has came. So this way you can use your uh, keyboard short, uh, short, shortcut, uh, shortcut, yeah. um, and uh, without mouse, you can do everything. You can access very uh, easily. Just uh, learn A to Z, and uh, you can do entire uh, things easily in your computer system. So here we'll uh, we'll write some uh, uh, in this document. I will enter that thing. See, now I am typing A. A for selection. C L E C T I O N. B uh, for Here B for bold and uh, here 
let us see for see for copy see for delete see for the document has been come in between d for the document whatever document e for whatever document is there that will come in between so here uh, just now we saw that the uh, entire document uh, has came in between aligns the line or selected text to the center whatever we want it will um, it will give in between the center of the screen okay and uh, next f for find And uh, G for go. H for history. I for italic. J for justification. K for insert. Insert a hyper link. L for left whatever document is there it will come to left side m for merging merging the document it will uh, the entire document uh, if we want in a uh, merging way Uh, it will indent the paragraph. You can say as a indent the paragraph. Yen for new. New page or new tab. It will open new. And uh, go for go for open. P for print. Q for it will apply in single space. Just now we saw na. We have gave some uh, here uh, number that uh, uh, we gave one point fifteen, one point five. So it uh, it will uh, go down and uh, this uh, uh, 
what we did is we brought this entire thing in like a single spacer. Next to R for right, right side. Yes for save the document. C for opens new window. will open new window in in for in for info n info g n i U for U for underline underline the text document whatever you selected and U B B for pasting pasting the document the blue part it will closes the close currently open document close current it will cut cut the selected document cut the selected document and why for why for to do to redo and uh, undo undone action just now we saw that uh, it is uh, why do uh, why for redo and uh, z for undo okay z for undo z for undo and action okay this way if we just remember these things see just we have to understand these all things just we have to and the a to z formulas a for selection b for bold c for copy d for delete e for center of the screen f for find g for go h for history i for italic j for justification k for Second hyperlink, L for left, M for merging, or uh, you can call as indent the paragraph. N for new page document, O for open, T for print, Q for 
apply single spacing to R, R for right side, S for save document, T for opens new window in incognito mode, U for underline the text document, V for, v for pasting the document, V for pasting our uh, document, W for close current open document, cut the for cut the selected document, and Y for to redo an undone action, Z for undo an action. So just uh, you people remember A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Whatever we learned our uh, childhood A to Z, just add to, here we learned in our childhood, we used to learn A for apple, B for ball, C for cat, D for dog, E for egg, F for fish. Same way, A for selection, B for bold, C for copy, D for delete, E for center of the screen. Same way we will remember, if we remember these entire thing, you are the king of the computers. So please, uh, for a computer student, it is necessary and uh, if common people, if uh, common people, they also want to become like professional, please follow this video and uh, try to grasp this thing. Uh, just uh, Whatever you learned at your childhood, just to prepare in those ways, uh, you will be one of the professional uh, person. Uh, so, um, if you are interested, uh, I'll do more and more videos. And in simple way, I'm going to explain. I will not make any confusion. If you people are confused, you can 100% place and message. And uh, whatever doubts you are uh, uh, having, you can uh, clear with me. I'm going to explain everything. So, I hope that if you people like the video, see here uh, at uh, 2 o'clock. It's almost 1.57 a.m. It's almost 2 o'clock. Uh, 2 a.m. I'm doing this video because uh, uh, I'm uh, working morning hours I go to office and uh, I come to I, I come at uh, uh, 6 or 7 uh, six, uh, in between 6 to 6.30 uh, time evening hours so after coming I have to schedule myself and then after 10 o'clock uh, I'll get time to uh, for my personal thing uh, I'll get time and uh, at 10 o'clock, uh, I just finished my dinner and then I have uh, thought that today I am going to do such a video um, and then I started, uh, I thought this from day 6 I will start. Already I did uh, 3 um, software side uh, videos like I, I, uh, ISO and uh, also timeline. Uh, and uh, you know, I started uh, two three. Then uh, even I have kept some videos of forensic, uh, cyber uh, related things. But I thought uh, I should uh, in between I should play some videos like uh, uh, basics. Uh, it must be basics also and uh, useful for everyone. Basics uh, which is useful for everyone. So if hope that if you people understand my uh, video please uh, give me one like subscribe and share this to as many as people mm, I am also new youtuber uh, I am also creating some uh, videos uh, I am trying to do better and better uh, actually I just said that uh, at 2 a.m. See, sharp 2 a.m. Uh, so, 
please uh, please appreciate my work uh, for uh, whatever i am doing hard work thank you everyone i don't want to waste your people time thank you